Paphos Archaeological Park. The park represents remains of an ancient city of Paphos, founded by the Greeks shortly after the Trojan War in the 12th century BC. Historians call it Neopaphos. The city was entirely destroyed by earthquakes in the 4th century AD. Here you can see the ruins of an amphitheater, a town square and entire streets with colonnades. Particularly valuable are the well-preserved mosaics of the 2nd and the 3rd centuries AD. They are in the house of Dionysius, which belonged to a wealthy Roman citizen. His estate was 2,000 square meters and occupied an entire block. The house had 40 rooms, 15 of which with mosaics based on ancient Greek and Roman mythology. Other mosaics are in the house of a Roman proconsul. Perhaps they even belonged to Cicero, who was proconsul in Cyprus for some time. Be sure to read about the mosaics on Wikipedia before visiting. It will be much more interesting if you understand their plot. Also, in the park is a fortress of the Crusaders, Saranta Colonus, which translates as 40 columns. The Crusaders conquered the island in the Middle Ages. The fortress was built from ruins of an ancient city and stood until an earthquake in 1222.